Growing up in the pre-internet age, analog horror meant whatever existential terrors advertising executives decided to throw at you at any given time of the day. And I'm not talking about public information films. They were supposed to scare you. I'm talking about adverts that you were meant to like and relate to. Here are some of the worst offenders. Liquid Prell Shampoo's The Isle of Green. Three incredibly creepy women, like the sirens of Greek mythology, implore you to come to the Isle of Green, where you will almost certainly be murdered and possibly used as a shampoo. It's like an ASMR made by the devil. Come to the beautiful Isle of Green, the land of liquid emeralds. Cascades of sparkling droplets, liquid prell. The beautiful Isle of Green. Liquid prell's extra rich formula bursts Burst. into torrents. Billowy lather. Leaves hair. Radiant. Shimmery. Luxuriously clean. Come, Come to, to the beautiful Isle, Isle of Green and know the luxury that liquid prell can give you. British pork. This ill-conceived advert for British pork made in 1984 features a father and husband seemingly at the limit of his sanity and liable to stop cutting the pork and start cutting up his family at the slightest provocation. Got what it takes, my wife. Got friends round. Got roast pork for lunch. Plenty of taste, British pork. Real value for money. Friends got plenty? No, Arthur's got plenty. We've all got plenty. Plenty to go round. My wife's got what it takes. British pork. What's it got? It's got the lot. Got pork for lunch on Sunday? Nor soup. A very creepy looking scarecrow decides to get out of the rain and consume the farmer's soup, which is made of the same vegetables as his own head. If he's willing to resort to cannibalism, then the farmer will surely be next and his family. Children watched this. Whether you're cold or whether you're wet, you'll weather it better with a warm, welcoming Nor soup. Like Nor blended golden vegetable. Wholesome, nourishing vegetables selected and blended for a soup that's thick but smooth. Soup in a cup or soup in a bowl. There's no soup more satisfying. Nor soup. So good you go. British Rail. This one kind of caught me by surprise. I enjoyed this advert as a child, but viewing it now I discovered a horrific addition at the end that I must have blocked out of my memory. Proceed at your own risk. kids a little treat. Take them up to London. It's so cheap with the special away day ticket. One adult pays the full fare and up to four of us go for only a pound each, providing one is a child. Don't just take my word for it. Ask a young expert if this is the age of the train. Land on your own moon. Sony's late 90s advertising executive clearly thought that the PlayStation should be advertised in the vein of an Aphex Twin video. I still see her alien face when I shut my eyes. Let me tell you what bugs me about human endeavour. I've never been the human in question. Have you? Mankind went to the moon. I don't even know where Grimsby is. Forget progress by proxy. Land on your own moon. It's no longer about what they can achieve out there in your behalf, but what we can experience up here in our own time. It's called mental wealth. (laughs) 
And lastly, we have the proof that nearly all early 80s adverts were made by people that had never even met a child, let alone had one, but certainly who hated them. Kinder, you both shaky. Me on Scrabbly. Chocka doobie! Doubly chocka doobie! Pop swabble! <laughs> Toy! Yodel yum and choco scrum with multi pop swabble dies! Oh, Grubbly! <laughs> Me scrubble now! Snuggle! Whee! Kinder Surprise from Ferrero. Bye then. <laughs>